Let's start off with that bizarre attack at a local grocery store. An unsuspecting woman sprayed with bodily fluids. This is the man police say was behind the sickening crime, and tonight there could be more victims. Fox 5 Stacey Cohan here with the News Edge on this. Stacey. Well, Brian, it happened just yesterday in the parking lot of a giant food store on Muddy Branch Road in Gaithersburg. And what this man is accused of doing is both disgusting and dangerous. Oh, oh, very nasty. Oh, that's really not good. Yeah, it's disgusting. It happened right in this parking lot outside this Gaithersburg grocery store. Police say 28-year-old Michael Edwards Jr. had been staring at a woman while she was in line inside and then attacked her in the parking lot. And a bottle like this was his weapon of choice. Police say the man approached a young woman from behind and used the pump to spray a liquid on her back and hair. The investigation revealed that that substance was in fact human semen. And it gets worse. After arresting and interviewing Edwards, police are convinced there are other victims and they are urging them to come forward. We're just concerned that somebody may have not known what that substance was and just thought it was a liquid substance, not knowing in fact what it was and didn't report it. Shoppers are sickened and frightened by the news. Well, it could be my daughter or somebody's daughter or, or child that, that could really lead to some more serious things. Yeah, that's sickening, very sickening. The neighborhood's nice, though. I mean, it's like I said, this is more of an anomaly than anything else. That's very disgusting, scary, especially with all the diseases out there nowadays. Well, police are running tests to determine if there are any additional health concerns resulting from that attack. And although Michael Edwards is currently charged with assault, he could face additional charges. Now, if you were attacked by this man, you are urged to contact Gaithersburg Police. They are looking for more victims. Brian? Stacey, go in tonight.